Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Gemini. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. All right. So I feel like this is about a decision to return uh, to someone and give them clarity about why they did something or why they behaved the way that they did, or why this is happening, okay? So there, they took a decision, they left, and now I feel like they've had time to think about it, and it's like there's a, a, a turnaround, and they are coming back to explain, okay, so this is why this is happening, you know? This is why I did this, you know? This is why. You're about to find out why somebody became suddenly really defensive. A tower moment occurred because of it. Okay, and so this person is here uh, lying in the Four of Swords energy and um, looking at their options, okay? They're studying what happened and looking at their options for a way out, you know, here, looking at the details, um, wanting some peace of mind, okay, wanting some peace of mind, this is getting something off their mind, okay, they're here, and they're thinking, and when they're thinking, the mind, you know, it's like the mind is coming up with all of these other things, and well, they're going to go back, and they're going to uh, they're they're going to um, put that in front of you. Okay, so it's not they're not coming back angry, but they are coming back still slightly defensive. Okay, that's what I see. Um, and so. I feel like this person loves you. I, I feel like they don't want this to end. Um, I feel like there's still a really deep connection, but there is an issue that is causing a little chaos between you two. Okay, so here we have uh, her, and uh, her, I mean, could be male or female, but um, the, the image on the card uh, is um, somebody who's thinking about someone it was very important to them, okay? Um, <clears throat> it could be um, she's thinking about change, okay? Um, it could be she's thinking about the change that just happened. She's thinking about this person. She's thinking about uh, their reaction to something. Uh, maybe she thinks they went to the extreme, or maybe she's even wondering what this is about, you know? what happened because they feel they need to come back to explain what happened so obviously she is clueless as to what is going on as to this attack there was an attack okay that she didn't see coming she didn't see this coming so why did they suddenly become really defensive like this and why did they do what they do did or say what they said that you're about to find out um i feel like you're waiting for them this is the same person and and yeah she's sitting there and she's waiting for them uh, obviously um obviously the relationship is ill, so to speak, right? Because there are some obstacles, some problems, but uh, but there's still attraction here, okay? Um, they're still both very attracted to each other. And I feel like this person, uh, there's a message coming, okay? But they're delivering it, okay? There's a message coming. There's news coming. She's waiting for it. She knows this is coming. She's waiting for this person to come because what happened doesn't make sense to her. So, I mean, it can't end like this. So she's waiting for them, and this information is very important to her, 
okay? She really, really wants to know what's on the other side of that wall. Why did they suddenly throw up this wall? What's going on? That's really, really important information that she would like to know. I mean, look at the book. And she's got it wrapped. The, these details that she's missing uh, are wrapped up in this book. And she really desires to have this knowledge, you know. But there's a wall there. All right. So what's behind that wall? Why did they throw up that wall? And why is it happening? It must have been happening often with the devil here. There seems to be, uh, there was a pattern. But this time, it's like, ooh. It went to the extreme, okay? This time, it ended badly. So, what what happened? And can we fix things is what she wants to know. So, she's waiting in expectation. And um, she's sitting there and she's thinking and she's wondering, you know? Here she is. She... Um, She's on, she wants the four of wands energy, okay? So she wants to deepen the relationship. She wants that open, honest, loving relationship. She wants that happily ever after. Maybe she wants to move in with this person, or maybe if they were living together, then maybe she wants to take that even further. Maybe she wants to get married to this person, but she's on the outside. She's on the outside looking at it. This is what she wants. It's where she wants to go. Okay, so she's waiting for this information to come to her. Like, is this still a possibility? You know, because we're not there yet, but I want to go there. She wants to go there. Because, you know, I, st you know, I still feel a really deep connection with you, you know. Um, so uh, this is what she wants. The Melodamantum. Well, that's about the uh, consequences of our actions. Um, and then this two of coins, and you can see that uh, bird up there. It looks pretty ominous, very threatening. Um, and so, well, uh, this can be somebody who uh, wasn't, thinking logically obviously in this this energy so this is the other person here they weren't thinking logic logically and uh oops <laughs> doesn't go there it goes over here um but this is their energy uh, so they weren't thinking logically and they uh caused a lot of damage okay um they became way too defensive and uh, if this has been in pattern then indeed they would need to reflect on that and uh, think about that and figure out uh, why they are so defensive where did that come from how long has this been going on trace the thread back to the past and find the root cause for that defensiveness then uh, then this person would be able to heal it. Now, I feel like this is what they are going to do, okay? Um, here they are coming back. This problem has to be fixed. It is a problem. The defensiveness is a problem. Uh, it has been a pattern, uh, and it can destroy this beautiful, beautiful connection that I see here. So it, that defensiveness, you have to find the root. If if they have not understood why why they be, become so defensive, then uh, then you need to help them to uh, to understand and point them in the right direction. Okay, you need to help this person. They need this help if they don't already see it. Okay, they're coming back. This is about to repair. Or to make a new. Um, they're afraid to take a fall. Um, I feel like they want to repair this relationship. Something needs to change. And you know that. So if they. Like I said. If they haven't uh, had this wake up call. Uh, if they haven't uh, done this inward journey. Um, then you need to point them in the right direction. You need to help them. It's important to you to have an open and honest, loving relationship. 
And if they're not talking, they're not being open. So there are things that they haven't been talking about um, that they would need to talk about. I feel like it brings up old pain, but uh, this will help them to heal it. You're about to learn something. There it is, right there. And there's the sun right here. So we can definitely have a positive outcome here with the sun. All right. So um, you're about to learn something. And what are you about to learn? You're about to learn why somebody suddenly became so defensive. That's what you are about to learn. Okay. Um, there's the information. It is coming to you again here. It's saying the same thing. It's this card here, this defensive card, is trapped right in between these two. So you are about to learn this, okay? Um, but I feel like this person wants to fight for this relationship, okay? Uh, they don't want to lose you. They're lonely. They're missing you. And they want to come back. I, I feel like uh, there you will see forward movement here, but ultimately, if you don't want to end up back here again because it has been a pat pattern, you need to get to the root of that defensiveness, okay? Communication will be very, very important. This is something that you will also need to work on, the communication and making them feel comfortable enough that they could open up about what it is that, you know, this, this wound that they're uh, keeping inside. And so um, here we have the fool. So this is a need to let go of anything that's been holding them down or weighing them down. And, and, um, and then you'll be able to move forward. Okay. So um, that is what I have for you. I thank you for watching for liking and for sharing my videos and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.